when Donald Gleason came up with the Gleason scoring system more than 40 years ago, uh, it was a huge breakthrough and is still one of the most reliable methods for parsing out the different types of cancer. Dr. Gleason, when he designed his system, he called for uh, designating Gleason 6 and lower cancers as not being cancers. However, there was a big pathology consortium and all this went through society review and he, his opinion was not listened to and Gleason 6 cancers were included as potentially malignant and uh, having the capacity to metastasize. Now, 40 years later, we learned that Dr. Gleason was correct, that the Gleason 6 and lower type cancers don't spread. That is the definition of a cancer, the capacity to spread. Tumors can enlarge, but if they can't break free, get in the bloodstream and go to another part of the body, they don't really act, they're not acting like a cancer. And so, this is what studies are now showing, that uh, Gleason 6 never spreads. However, we've got an industry now that's been treating Gleason 6 as if it's potentially malignant now for over 40 years, and uh, there's a, this industry is very predisposed to treating everything that's called cancer, and of course patients are, are frightened when they hear that word as well. So we need to start redefining how we consider Gleason 6, uh, and uh, the industry has not changed the name. They're still calling it cancer. But people that have studied this issue now know that Gleason 6 does not meet the basic criteria for a definition of being a cancer.